Mitai was tuned on the program Love Clinic on Adami Mogo 93.1 FM between 10 p.m. and 1 a.m. Every Tuesday night, let's talk, let's discuss the issues or challenges you are facing in your relationship or marriage. Femi Mitai was tuned, your love therapist will be ready to share your relationship or marriage challenges with you. Plus, lecture on issues in relationships, text messages, feedback from you, and plenty of sentimental music. Every Tuesday night from 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. on Adami Mogo 93.1 FM. Join me. I will love you forever. I will love you forever. The music of Timmy Dakolo. I will love you. Yawumi equals this one. Nothing more to say. I will love you forever. Yeah, definitely, definitely, I will love you forever. And uh, with that, I am saying good evening and welcome to the program Love Clinic. On Adami Mogo 93.1 FM. I must sincerely, firstly, and sincerely apologize 
and uh, that we are coming on a bit late tonight. Um, we had some sponsored programs that we needed to take. You know, like I say every day, I say, bring your sponsored programs here. Come and sponsor this program. Um, come and buy some part of this program so that we can remain on air, so that we can uh, be able to buy diesel and run a life for you. And so uh, when those calls are getting responses or responded to, uh, we don't have a choice than to thank God that um, um, that they came, that they are coming. Don't forget that before now, the program used to start by 10 o'clock. It went um, to 10.30, and then tonight we started at 11. But I can assure you uh, that by next week, we should be starting by 10.30 by His grace. Yes, all things being equal. So first of all, I must apologize to you, my wonderful and great listeners and followers, um, for your patience tonight. But I promise you, I will not disappoint you. I will not let you down. Um, together we are going to rob minds. Together we are going to um, exchange ideas, views, knowledge, experiences. Uh, because no man is an island. Um, no one knows it all. Even if I sit here, it is just a privilege. It doesn't mean that I'm better than you are. Uh, I'm just opportuned. It's just an opportunity for me to be on this seat and um, address you and listen to um, your problems and then we solve the problems together. Um, so do not make that mistake of thinking that I'm better than you are. I am not. I am not. Even if you are deceiving me, I can't deceive myself. I know I am not. Outside there, I know there are lots of very brilliant and intelligent people, far, far more brilliant than I am, more intelligent than I am. But I give God the glory that I can be counted among you. That's very important to me, that I can be counted among you. Um, to me, um, is enough. Is enough for me. Is enough for me. So tonight, I say welcome to Love Clinic. I am your love therapist, Femi Tywo Stone. The man will not the smoke, will not the drink. The Ochi Laws were one of Adami Mogu 93.1 FM. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I am excited. Yes, no time to waste. Uh, oh, baby, I hope you don't select some correct music there for me, all right? Um, uh, before we go take any music again, let's. Um, I would like to run through what we talked about last week. And then um, tonight we'll talk about um, how to make um, your man happy. Last week it was how to make your wife happy. Yes, so that... Um, if at any time she decides to leave you, I told you, she will not have peace, rest of mind, wherever she is. Don't forget that naturally we compare people. She will start comparing the new man to you. And if that one is not able to beat your record, she begins to miss you. She begins to regret that she ever left you. Is enough flogging for her. Yes. She will be there, she will still be thinking about you, longing for you, calling you, begging you, whatever. It's enough punishment for her. For not appreciating the love you showed her, for not appreciating the care, the understanding, yes, for not adding value to you, for not being contented, yes, that God gave you to her. So wherever she will be, she'll be thinking, she'll be lamenting, and that is enough pain for her on your behalf. <laughs> Don't say I'm wicked. I'm not wicked. Instead of you um, going an extra mile, maybe running, raining curses at her, wishing her bad, uh, praying negatively for her, um, doing her juju, uh, setting her up, beating her, and so on and so forth. You don't need it. You don't need it. This is enough flogging for her. You can imagine, for years, she'll be lamenting and regretting. <sighs> How much pain can be more than that? How much pain can be more than that? Uh, which means also that uh, whoever comes her way, she might never get satisfied with that person. Because you've created a mark. You've written your history in her memory, in her life. You've made a very beautiful mark. 
happen. So whoever is going to step into those shoes of yours, that she threw away, my brother, my sister, it will not be easy because there can never be another you. She ever, if she ever did. It's very important. It's very important. So um, these are magnetic ideas. These are cohesive ideas. These are ideas that are that glue people together. And any wise woman will not want to leave that kind of man. If you are wise. The same thing we will finish tonight. Any wise man will not want to leave that kind of woman that I'm going to tell you to, to prepare. To prepare. So tonight, um, um, the reason why I, I'm, I'm talking about all these things is that there is no school for marriage. People that go to a school of marriage are counselors, maybe men of God. How many of us have gone to school to say, uh, in the department where I do, I do one course on marriage, teaching me how to live with my man or how to live with my woman. It's only churches and mosques that do counseling for us these days. And how many of us are even taking them serious? How many of them are even learning? You understand? And one very disadvantageous thing for a woman or a man to, to be is on, to be unteachable, to be uncorrectable. That is, you don't want anybody to correct you, you don't want them to teach you anything. My brother, my sister, you go lost, tired. You go create so much problem for your own life, you go tired. Whether you are a man or you are a woman, your wife can teach you, your husband can teach you. I've always said it, when somebody teaches you anything, educates you on anything, put her like this for your hand. Thank you. Well done. Stand up. When you now go to sit down on your own or you lie down on your own, look at all those things where that person teach you. Which one you think say you go take inside? Which one you think say correct? Which one you think say you fit, adopt, or adapt to? Where if you swallow, you take her. You might not take everything hook, line, and sinker, but take enough that is why they pay me these days. Somebody go sit down. All through the time where it takes sit down, now phone, phone, phone. You don't have time to think. You have no time to meditate. You have no quiet moment. You will continue to do the same mistake and see the same result every time. After you go say life, tire you. Life no the interest. Sometimes you need to sit down and just be quiet. Sit down and be useless if you think so. But for me, when you are quiet and you sit down, you are useful. Think. Uh, maybe thinking is not the right thing, the, the right word. Uh, ruminate. Uh, meditate. Look at everything you've done, you've said, you've interacted, you've discussed, you have, you've argued for the day. And ask yourself whether um, 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 the day has been fine, what have you learned? Don't forget that everything, whether your phone, no, they run away. Anytime you carry the phone like this, you open them, they start from where you stop. So why are you in a hurry? Why must you be on the phone 24 hours? Take time to be quiet. Take time to think. All right. Um, let me just run through what and what uh, we discussed last week. I said, make your wife happy. I said, do you want to know the magic to make any woman or lady like you and not want to leave you? Do you want your lady or woman or wife to leave you and come back? Do you want your lady, woman or wife to follow another man and not enjoy the place? Do you want your lady, woman or wife to follow another man and stay there regretting leaving you? I say if yes, then uh, let us talk about what to do to her while she's with you. Be truthful to her 95%. I say 95% because nobody can be 100% truthful. You know day, forget that thing. You know day. You know day. Um only God now get hundred percent. So that the many three, four percent, I say no take and talk through. And I give an example. I said if you have baby mama outside, don't open your big mouth. Go house, go tell your wife. I get one babe for her side. Because some women never ever recover from it. Some women no feel take up. So women are different. We strong pastors. They're not also because your, your friend did it to the wife. You go try it to your wife. Your wife is sick from there. And I'll ask you, do you want to kill her? So why tell her? 
for her own good, please don't. Unless she catch you. When she catch you red handed, no need to lie again. Confess your sin and beg for forgiveness. Don't forget some women might never forgive you. Some women that if you change in a marriage, you should be very, very careful. Uh, know the kind of woman where you marry. Her. Uh, be very caring. Um, every time, especially when she's sick or ill. Correct her with love and politeness. Don't um, ever use abusive words on her or curse her. No go they curse her. You die. This is that. You don't need it. Don't need it. Don't say that to your wife. Abba, what you happen now? In the market, when you take her for shopping, let her sit on your lap as she tests the new shoes and so on and so forth. Hold her back for her if she's boarding or you carry many bags, help and carry some. Carry some of her luggage for her when walking or going out, at least 90% of the times. Notice that she's ill and get her drugs, no matter how tired you are. Whether you're just coming back from work, it's 9 p.m., you are deadly tired, and you find her having temperature, she's not feeling then you ask her, what have you taken? Do you have pastor at home? No, darling. Do you have uh, malaria medicine? No, darling. Okay, you check her, check her. She's a blessing of malaria. This not this thing. If you don't want to do self-medication, just go outside. Get her some uh, analgesic. Analgesic. Uh -huh. May she take. So that by daybreak, you will go for tests. If you don't want to do self-medication. But if you already know her system, you know your systems, you can decide on what to do. But get her the drugs. No matter how late that night, anyway, you can find it. That's why it's always good to have a first aid box at home. My daddy used to have it. With the hang for what those days, Nadeko. We put all the old first aid something inside. Are you dying, dead uh, Hydrogen peroxide. When my father take clean our ears those days, God go bless that man. And so on and so forth, they did cutting woo. Book boy, low and bear. Scissors, everything they did. Always have it at home. I don't think it's too expensive um, these days. Kiss her forehead if you come in and see her asleep. Sometimes she no sleep. She just go pretend like say she sleep. Now lie. That's why they kiss her for it. She they, she they notice her. All these things are what you do to leave memories in her. And then if she follow under man, she no go enjoy the place. If you come home much earlier than expected, eat anything available. E.g. bread, Gary. Uh -huh. Or do the kicking yourself. That is, you come home. You know, especially you go come that early. You come come early. She never cook. No good. You go to share the frown for her. Now nice you come her sometime. No, you have come home uh, to surprise her. So don't spoil it by quarreling or nagging. Don't. Just adapt to anything you say. Or maybe as they come for rule, buy something we go eat. No go as good as stress them. She begin on up and kitty kitty kitty. No, no, you don't need them. Just like one man, he, 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 he travel how many months so now he come back. Now let the wife be there also. Very nice, faithful wife, oh. very decent woman, well of us the admire for community. The man came. Open the entire house. Let's travel, oh. Since more than eight months. Leave the woman here. Travel, they come. That night, immediately they open the What's supposed to happen? You know, I say, I could rush him, Bonnie. Go rush him. The least way if he saved the woman that day, and I say, he did monthly something. If not, now for inside place, suppose they warm up, warm up. What you want to take that woman do that night? That day, they call us band. The man came, he sleep. He sleep like that too. And the following day, he begin to touch the wife. Who's kind of husband you be? Eight months, you don't go. Eight months, you don't go. You have no excuse. You are tired. Are you tired? So you die. You tired waiting. You tired. Eight months. Three months. Lasso. You don't leave your wife. Go. Three months. You come back. That night. That night. Up back. Talk by He said. You have no excuse. Ah, oh, you know the other they talk. All this way you go chop, where you go drink, where you know say when you enter like now, so your bone will strong like I'm rubber own. Now you go all take the all drinker. If na alcohol drinker, where you know say they good for you. If na bitter cola in the shop, where your body they where you go. You might go no say yes, you come that night. Let me say you go, you go lie down. Then you following day you tell me, you tell her I love her. I no agree that one. I no agree. Uh -huh. uh, so when you come back from work, don't stress her. You came home early because you want to make her life um, interesting. You want to surprise her. You want to make her happy. So don't spoil it by quarreling. Say she never cook. She didn't know you were coming because you made it a surprise. Even if you say you tell her, say say you come. What if before she go market come, you don't land? Well, I take life easy now. Some people, they, some men, no get shame. Once they are hungry, they are like animals. 
You know they? They want you man leave you one day, no miss you. Say too like food, you be small picking. There are some men that they eat their picking style. They don't they no call and say come shop. That's why they pick in their eye go the red like lion eye. They the hungry, they say one day. But the foolish man, the foolish man go bale food first before he say my children take this. Even the house where they don't get enough, oh, the man is struggling to bale food first before the children. You are not a man. I don't want to talk for radio. I for say you are a use. I don't go talk the word finish. Man. Complete the word. You are a use man. I know complete them. All right. Or do the cooking yourself and save um, her or put her own for fridge. As a man, you come, you want to cook. Don't ever do the mistake of cooking only your own. No. Cook your wife own. Join now. Is it a sin say you cook? That's how our parents, they teach all of us, man and woman, how to do home chores. How to cook. Surprise her once in a while. Be a wonderful man. So that if she mistakenly leave you one day, she never get herself. Before 30 minutes, she don't begin to miss you. All those small, small sweet things where they do for her, don't begin to miss you. So, I said, don't ever nag her. No go to call your wife like woman. You are a man. And if she say, you don't vest, she vest, you see, I can't hug you. Come hold you. I was in a better. Now me and my girlfriend quarry. Nothing to hide. We learn from each other. And some of them We quarry low. After I don't talk with her, I won't talk. Now she provoke. She get temper. Now she provoke. Verse. Maybe the other she expect me to raise and do. Or raise voice. Oh, I don't raise. Now he rush me for what I said. <laughs> now he rush me. <laughs> she rush me for what I said. Give me blow, give me slap, give me. I don't talk. You already look at. She don't expect say ah today so go kill me here. <laughs> I don't even know where I see that wisdom that day. Now I see that they look at. Now he hold me for neck. It's that for my life. Hold me for neck. You kill me today. I don't talk. When she tired, you know what she do? She begin cry. She begin cry. I can't depend her. She they always tell me till she left. Say, you know, believe that day. Say that day I surprise her. I come the pet and pet and pet and. And I may stop to cry now. Say the things I tell you now is for your own good. I'm only trying to correct you now. Did I insult you? Did I abuse you? I didn't now. I just corrected. Is it wrong? She now started begging me. The rest, no ask me what it happened. I'm a Christian. Don't ask me what happened. <laughs> oh, baby, don't ask me. So we settle the matter like that. To God be the glory. So, there are some um, ways you do things and your man or your woman belonging not to uh, live. And I said, be average in bed. Be average in bed. I've always spoken about that. It's very, very important. Don't say... Uh, not every day uh, love making our food my brother my sister na food na pandet yam and egusi soup if you know the average you go break that marriage no let any man woman deceive you love making is not a joke it's very 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 important in marriage in that matter, I call the very. Don't let anybody know. Some women go say, I beg you. Me to not food. Now every day they do it. I keep it. Now lie. Don't say you want to do it every day. You say, be doing it. Woman, not go tell you, say, tire. Baba just go say, when you hear woman, they say, no, no, no. It means yes, yes, yes. Where did Baba just go? Kuali Adenuga. Baba just go. I remember those days. It can be super. There's any time a woman says, no, 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 she means yes, yes, yes. If you sabi do and wear for where a woman, they tired, they tire, they're full. Now, if you know sabi do and you go say, me, you leave them. All right? So, that is that about um, making your wife happy. Today, we are going to talk about um, making your husband happy. So that your husband said, no, go feel leave you. Yes, we'll talk about that. But we'll take a short break. But before then, 
Uh, let me tell you that um, um, the program, of course, is open to um, sponsorship. We expect you to come and uh, put some money on this program so that we can continue to buy this zoo. It's not easy to survive in Lagos. Um, in the midst of how many radio stations in Lagos? More than 64. In case you don't know, they give you the information. In Lagos alone, we have more than 64 radio stations. So to survive here is not a joke. And we need this zoo to survive. So call us on 080 55 for sponsorship. Marketing and sponsorship. 080 The second number is um, 080 I repeat the second number, 080 When you call that one, it is Madam Vicky. Okoro Dudu that will pick it. She's the head of marketing. And that first one that ends with 171, I should be the one to pick it. And then we'll talk, we'll discuss business. We have other lines for marketing. Uh, like I said, oh, um, some other time I'll bring those two other numbers for you so you can call any one of us and discuss um, um, the business or sponsorship um, with us. This number, it is Zembu, you want to take the call for program. The one for program, we'll take the call now, 082 and second one at 193. Don't forget, the marketing one ends with 171 and 172. That's for marketing. The one for calling into a program ends with 192 or 193. So a lot of people mix it up. They go to the call marketing line, thinking, say, in a program line. All right. So don't forget, like, our rules here. I say, if you are a man, don't tell me you are a woman. If you are Yoruba, don't tell me you are Indigo. If you are Hausa, don't tell me you are Fulani. Give me your correct tribe, your correct um, religion. If you are a Christian, Tell me you are Christian. If you are a traditional worshiper, let us know. And if you are a great Muslim, let us also um, um, know. Nothing wrong with the three religions. Nothing. Any religion we you serve, nothing wrong with them. So far, you are not taking human life. You are not taking human blood. You are calling the same God and he answers you. That is your religion. It is beautiful. So continue in it. I'm not against anybody's religion here. All right. And... Um, what else again? I say, give me your real location. Give me your very close name. If you are um, um, Bini, give me a Bini name. Osage. Agbonwanete. Names like that. Uh -huh. Don't go and give me, when you are Bini, you start giving me name like uh, Okun. Uh, Abang. That is not, um, uh, because we have different type, tribes, religion, culture, tradition, and all the rest. That will help me to guide me in uh, uh, exchanging the um, solution of whatever problem you raised um, with you, all right? And don't also forget that right now we are on Facebook at Adamimogo 93.1 FM. Facebook at Adamimogo 93.1 FM. And of course, we are on YouTube. Uh, we are also on um, 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 TikTok. We are on um, Instagram. We are everywhere. Adamimogo 93.1 FM live. That is where we are now. So when you go there, please, help us share, help us like, help us subscribe. Pass your comments. Let us know uh, how we can serve you better with your comments. And in those comments, put your location. Where are you commenting from? Let us know. Are you in Niger Republic? Are you in Togo? Or are you in Cameroon where you are protesting over the fact that we remove oil subsidy? <laughs> Wherever you may be on Facebook at Damimogo 93.1 FM. Go there and um, follow us, like us, share, subscribe. Do everything that you can do on all our social media handles. And also, um, as you do that, you come down to my own social media handles also. Uh, my own is um, Talk We Make Sense. Talk We Make Sense on Facebook. Talk We Make Sense on TikTok. Talk We Make Sense on um, YouTube. And then on Instagram, I am Femi Stones 2014. There, we share videos we share um talks we talk about safety security and relationship um on those places and then just go there share like subscribe follow and pass your comments and let me know where you are commenting from and um how best i can um um, um serve you serve you let me put it that way all right we'll take a short break now when we come back we'll talk about how to make your man happy so that even if he tries to leave you, no go feel go. And that woman no go feel snatching from your hand. Yes, 
If he goes more, he go run, come back. He go be like say you juju na lie, na your character, your behavior, na you take time down, because he go cherish you, because he no go see another woman like you by the grace of God when he begin to do some of these things I'm going to say tonight. Uh -huh. So we'll come back. Oh baby, let's take one beautiful music and then we'll be back again. Femi Taiwo Stone is my name and I'm here working with Oh Baby, uh, ladies and uh, men to gents. We'll come back. Na 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 na. <laughs> Anybody we won't fight you Men that come there already know I'll be right beside you Like the wall of Jericho They don't know, they don't know They don't know what's going on When I get so, when I get so When I get so, my baby boy I'll be a soldier for you I'm getting the time for food You should know I got you and you don't need to guide me to I'll be right beside you In anything that you do If you ever need saving I will be running to you Running, running, running to you I'll be running to you Running, running, running to you Anywhere that you go to Running, running, running to you I'll be running to you When I'm looking for trouble, it's cause I know that I got you. One in my best, everybody, oh, oh, and it's because of your comfort. And any time that I'm out of control, you never, never let go. You'll be fighting, and I'll be right there with you. I may be small, but I'm mighty, and I go run up for you. And anybody waves I be, yeah, no be you pull it, I be around. And if I ever need saving, I'll be running to you. Running, running, running to you. I'll be running to you. All right, I'll be running to you. The music of Chike. Featuring Simi. Simi. I call that name twice, right? <laughs> because uh, Simi is one of my um, favorite female artists. And of course, Tenny and a host of others, including um, Tiwa Savage and the host of them and the drummer you just name it and the dancer that great traditional um cultural dancer um is it yemi alade also okay all right those are my um favorite female artists in nigeria and so tonight on love clinic um, um i'm using that to put us in a very good mood at damimogo 93.1 fm now we day love clinic where we they listen to each other problems and we they try to solve them together now we do so and i day here this night i they work with old baby yes ladies are men to gent uh, that one of my right hand man um together will make your night interesting will make your night memorable all right i am a love clinic i am a love therapist for me i was stone the man will not smoke will not the drink or chill us one or for dan mogo 93.1 FM. Don't forget to join me on Facebook at Adamimogo 93.1 FM. Adamimogo 93.1 FM. Please help me call your friends and uh, brothers and sisters, colleagues, 
um, neighbors who are not in Lagos, who are outside Lagos, outside Nigeria, to please join me on that um, Facebook page at Dabibogo 93.1 FM. Uh, much later, I will share um, um, this recording on my own Facebook page, which is um, Talk With Me Sense and um, Taiwo Femi. Taiwo Femi, those are the two pages that I have on Facebook. I will share it later and then share it on YouTube. Share it everywhere. TikTok, you name it. Um, and then um, um, you can get to follow me. I said, make your man happy. Make your man happy. You see, women are like little boys. Any woman we get our key, they go say she used juju. There's a key to hold a man. When you are stubborn, no, they work. You they argue, mm -mm. they show too no. Mm -mm. Uh, you too tough. Mm -mm. You are restless. Mm -mm. Uh, you are disobedient. Mm -mm. All those things, not the whole man. Uh, you they push one. Are uh, they summarize everything while they talk here by saying that you see that woman? What did they call Mumu? Among the gay friends, where somebody gay, that one they call Mumu, now they win. <laughs> and they tell her secret, now they win. He go tell, she go suffer, she go hear them, now they win. When push comes to shove, when they want pick wife, when friends want pick wife for their friend, now that type of the point. Say that lady, never say I argue with you one day. Anything you talk, now they do. Any, now I know you pass. Now they obedient pass. That woman, now they win. Somebody say, there are some ladies, they can pretend though. You go pretend, for how many years you want to pretend? I said the man or the woman, no smart. Your real nature, your real nature, go smell, come out one day. The devil in you, if you get devil, you go show. They go say, I say, eh! Now go save me, oh, say I never marry her. Now say it be your father. So I either say character be like smoke. Then if you hide them, if you wind up for inside car, you put on AC, you pass where smoke they fume like that. Uh, Ojota, uh, Olu Sosu dump, you go still feel the smell. No matter how small, tiny, you will feel and say, hmm. Upon say you wind up, you put on AC. So character be like smoke, then if you hide out. After some time, you go, boss, come out. All right, I say, make your man happy. So that if another woman, they do her eye, not go listen, not go look there, not go wash. Even though he looks there, go just shop, you go rock ass. You go shop, you go rock ass. Now you still get your man. Now those characters I want to teach you now. This is why I talk yesterday about uh, making your wife happy. Add your own joy now. There are so many things you do that will make a woman happy, uh, excited, laughing. Uh -huh. If you can be crack joke again, they crack joke. But don't talk all the time. As a man, don't talk all the time. Even as a woman, don't talk all the time. So I say make your man happy. I say uh, what you will not eat, don't smell it. That is number one. For any woman, which you not go shop, not smell them. What do I mean? Don't go and start doing a miss and boom description of your husband. No, he has to be tall. He has to chocolatey in color. He has to white has good white set of teeth. He has to have seven pack. He has to be a graduate of medicine, pharmacy, law. He has to have attended uni, Ben, uni, lag, UI, uni, learning. You hear me nowhere. Where you want to You hear me nowhere. If you see graduate, if you not talk. <laughs> you see the one way you talk, if you not go to school, where where. Do you want to get where they chocolatey if you don't get seven pack? 
the way we tall, where they get chocolate, if you know if you speak good English. The way we tall, where church, where the way where you like. If you be saying a pass, take over for university, you don't know book. <laughs> Nobody complete, and I will they tell you. Now go to raise the bar for yourself, not create problem for yourself. Be moderately average. Yes. So, as a woman, when the men they approach you, the one way you know say you not like, you know for go feel grief for this is not your kind of man. You know feel manage them. Don't start the relationship. That's number one. The one way they follow you, talk with your spirit, they say you no agree. Your spirit say no, no agree. Your spirit say no, no agree. I tell God, beg you. Obey your spirit. Because everybody mind, spirit, they warn us with that. We know they hear word. I for telling I want to do this night, but that radio with there, I'm not fit talking. My mind warned me. Stone, don't go there. No go there. I say no. Ah, if I don't go there now, they go say I don't be mad. I want to show my skill. Now, I mean, it's my seal. So anything your mind they tell you, follow up. Wait, you not go eat, not go smell up. Not to say you want to go shopping money. So many women don't hook. Regrettingly, they did yet they regret they don't hook. Now you buy they say attend uje. You want to go chop the man money. You want to go show and say you wise. Many women they wear the day to day they regret. So anybody will know say you know fit. Marry, not data. I say first, also and foremost, marry the man that loves you seriously. Among all the men where they pursue you, he gets one or two there be say they are crazy about you. The question you go ask me be say, how you go take no? Of course, I agree with you. There are playboys. Playboy go go out of your way, go buy you gifts, go take you out, go do this, go sweep you off your feet. You mad the sweets a bit of you are right. You say I ah, want take no. Now, make I give one of the commonest exams. When you get that kind of boyfriend, push her, make you come find you for house. Let your father shout for her, your mother shout for her. What are they doing for you? They are testing him. If he truly loves you. If not true, say like their daughter. God bless our parents. I repeat, God go bless our parents. They go take firewood, they pursue you. Take stick, they pursue you. Pour you water. Leave my daughter alone. Leave my daughter alone. You see the boy, you see they come. The next thing you go hide for one sign, I wish you go take the call you. They blow with you. Anytime you go, don't tell you. Anytime I blow with me, you come outside. Till your father go discover again, saying that with you, they take the draw. <laughs> come outside. All those things like that. Your brothers they go disturb him. They go do this. You will see him. You go they insist. And when they come, nothing concerned with waiting day between your legs. So he's more interested in seeing you. The way he treats you, the way he talks to you, the way he's bothered about you. Though nobody feels still know him, the mind of a man or a woman, 100%. But at least you go try. With all those wala and those tests, you go feel get 70%. Say, bless it. Among all of them, oh, this one not carry me play. The way you go take home, you go respect your parents, you go respect your father and your mother, your parents and sisters. Even when they insult him and talk to him, you know, go say, I'm vexed. Now you go to shout for your brother. Why are you talking to him like that? Don't you know him? He's my boyfriend. The small boy. Waiting. Which shoes like boyfriend? See, he throws another and all this ground. The guy no go worry. He go see the call. He go see the call. Until the day where your parents go say, go and bring that man. Let me see him. We want to see your parents. You go bring in parents. You know, say this one, you do what? He's serious. Upon that, you are still risking it. Then the next thing you do again is to add prayer. Go to God in prayers. There are some people, they, their own form of prayer now to sleep and dream. Some now to pray together with some people. Some now to consult their pastor or prophet, a imam. 
By the time you go to two, three places, their message should rhyme over a particular one. So you know that you have tried your best. And so after you've done all of that, um, he has picked you or you have picked him. You have agreed for him. I don't do na wedding. Do everything. My darling. My darling woman. Now, now, go, go, go. The work, they start. Don't ever do the mistake. Say, you know him. You don't know him. I repeat, you do not know anybody. Even the man does not know you. You should not know the man. When I don't date for seven years, <laughs> that will not mean anything. As soon as I married, now, now, I behave your one begin show. All those ones I do, when I, they do courtship for five, six, seven years, na camo. Camouflage and they call her. Everybody a package. So that she go greet your own, he go greet your own, everybody a package. Now your true character behavior one begin show. So, what do you do? Start studying him afresh. Don't deceive yourself that you already know him, even if you've courted for years. Open a new fire, start studying him every day. Don't forget to always ask yourself. Am I doing it right? Am I correct? This thing way this my man complain. Is he correct? Is he right? Don't always deceive yourself that you are right, that you are correct. Now only in the wrong, now let the man the wrong. No, 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 no. Check yourself and work on yourself as you are studying him. I say when he's talking to you, especially if in the angry, don't talk back to him angrily. I tell you this way you could do it, say. If he knows you for one day, they miss you. If you travel, say the good mommy place, you want to spend one month. Before you spend two weeks, you don't begin to shout. You don't do. No, come ask. If he say, don't talk to you, you don't agree. Eh, you can ask one man. Then they look your eye, be. Then lie you. Now, stay away. You want to push you, you come back home. He's already missing you. Don't be saying they'll tell you, say, not trust you. No. Now, indirectly, so you, like, you come back home. Then they miss you. And that is the advantage of that trip where you go. It's a test of whether you two don't they miss her, don't they miss you. So when he's angry and talking to you, don't talk back at him angrily. No matter how pembuish your husband is, when I mean by pembu, let me say your husband is short. Let me say short. I say don't overrate him and don't underrate him too. No overrate, be say no look and say. He supposed no. She been a graduate. She been senior me. She be this. No, 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 no. Nobody will know I finish you. And also it depends on where you grow. Uh -huh. It depends on who you are, who you mix with. Oh. Maybe no mix before. Oh. When one learns so many things, you've got not to overrate, over expect from him. No, no, no. He's a human being. He can disappoint you. can fall your hand in some areas. At the same time, don't look down on him. Don't underrate him. Avoid argument with him. What do you do follow your husband? They argue for. Whether you know pass him, you know pass you. Oh, I don't hear. I don't hear. If you like yourself, don't be arguing with your man. Men are not the like her. Be so obedient that he begins to feel that you are a fool. Yes. Play mumu for him. Obey him. Listen to him. Do whatever he wants. Every time, everywhere, he go come begin. Even a foolish man, he go come the thing say you be fool. Any man will see that kind of woman thing say you man a fool. Now you be fool. Take advantage of it and enjoy her. You are looking at her that she's a fool. Where you see fool? Since I they were for my life, I never see fool. I never see mumu. If you don't see, show me. Oh. I've never seen a mumu. You know they. That's not the talk for this night. I will go into details. Use your brain well. Use your initiative. At times, use your brain well. Not be everything you go away making teach you. Suppose know some things where you're supposed to do. Send text or call him if he's not at home. Even if um, uh, him or yourself, if he say you they disturb him, they do him. They do him. The way you know go day, go na go quarry. All those things go they miss you. But if not you do it before, you don't miss anything. Avoid his phone. 
avoid in secret places for instance some things they load way in keep keep you know when they touch and no go there you hear me well you no go there but if you must touch all those in hidden things when you hide rearrange them back perfectly as if say you no touch them so if you know say you know sabi rearrange something back as you see them then don't go and touch anything because you go no say you go there you go no say you go there and when you go there when you go touch anything don't mention it until you use the mouth tell you just keep quiet i like say you don't see anything i like say you don't know what they happen no talk then uh even when he come they talk about the thing those things we in hide he come to talk up no do i like say don't see him before he say keep quiet eh, okay all right ah. if nobody has determined i don't see me i no 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 see me i know the search house no see me but if you know say you be the type of say you know if you see me your mind keep quiet or you know if you make you no know, react no go to the search house so anything will go up must come down one day you go see here so don't be in a hurry cook his favorite meals and when he's telling you about those things where he hide where in they tell you keep quiet no go they make your mouth sharp because when your mouth is sharp you go jabber you go jabber you go no say you don't search everywhere don't you if you don't like her cook his favorite meals don't disturb him over small small buys things where you want buy small small things like i want buy salt i want to buy uh Hiru. I want buy onion. Go to the store for twenty nine, thirteen, thirty nine, fifty nine, hundred. I wait till Apple now. Tell you go market. No thief money inside the money. You can't go market. Inside that way, thief they buy. Be clean. Smell nice. Behave like a woman. Not go to do like Van Damme. You too strong. You strong. Mm, men only like him. Behave like a woman. Be feminine. Be prayerful. Serve God. Serve God, making his answer. You they go church, you they go much last you they pray, you do your five days, five hourly prayer. Do I'm as a correct Muslim babe. If you are a Christian girl, go church, go fellowship, go uh, Bible study. They pray, making sure the fire prayer for us. She buri baba, she baba, holy ghost fire. Mouth must make it. Mouth bam. Then when you sit on top of mat as a Muslim girl, you hold that tetes, we they do am. Where you they pray? Where they pray? When you finish. Tell us, he may talk at me. <laughs> Indirectly, I tell him, he say, I prayed for you. Mm. All right, don't ever curse him, no matter what he do. Don't ring curse at your husband. Surprise him on his special days, maybe birthday, wedding anniversary, etc. Even if he does not remember your own, don't worry. It's no good, they call him, say, you know, they buy a bed. Even if you want to learn, make, make sure that they win the happy that Jesus here. You ain't never remember my birthday. Mm, I don't tell I do you. After I go say you love me, love me one day, never remember my birthday indirectly. Once you face on the chain, stop the talk. Keep the house clean. Wash his clothes for him with or without washing machine. These are the things where they will not see you because they miss you. Arrange his clothes and shoes for him where they are supposed to be. It doesn't mean that you are a slave. I say welcome and accommodate his family. If you must reject them, do them diplomatically with style. Don't be too confrontational in rejecting his family. No man likes it. Be his gist mate when he come from work. Go and sit down with him in the parliament at the gist. Making the drama about with you. Making the gossip. You can gossip your neighbor. Gossip me. Me where they here. I no go here. So what they concern me with you when I talk, you and your wife. Or you and your husband sit down with him on a gossip gossip belly full is your legitimate right anybody who can go window go to listen i ain't sabi wait if i go on a window go ahead and talk so gossip gist do i'm a ball whatever but well, respect yourselves discuss business and progress of him and the family with him that means on our family discuss business discuss progress make his children to thank him whenever he pays their school fees Tell them, Junior, go and thank Daddy. Daddy just paid your school fees. Okay, but Junior will come. Daddy, thank you. Daddy go say, for what now? Nah? Hey, Daddy, you paid my school fees now. Nah. So, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. He's happy that even though the boy don't know or the girl don't know, the mother told him or her. And the boy or girl came to say thank you. These are the things where your man will take they appreciate you. He don't go tell you where they appreciate you. He go to thank him, God say, give you this kind of wife. 
I say make his children to respect and love him. Some say you go to tell the children, so you go make them hate their papa. No man likes it. Keep his bed, uh, his bad part away from his children, friends, and family. Everybody get bad part. Don't go and be telling your family or the friends or the children. Unless he don't reach level where you know if he bear them again. Oh, now don't fight, scatter. Talk your own, no. But not be all say go still talk. There are some terrible, terrible ones where you go need to keep for them. We say go need to keep for you. Because when I feel still settle. But those also, you endure, endure, endure away, no say this thing. Talk and command. If not, if you're not first, you talk, that's like to say that you're a bad wife or, or bad husband. Be very obedient. Attend to him whenever he's dull, down, sick, or in a bad mood. Show you care even if he shouts at you. Treat your man like your boy, child. Feed him. When I say scold him, that means talk to him with love about what you don't like. That is the scolding. Not say go go the abuse him. No. Um, that is if need be. Pet him, protect him. One woman did the husband travel. Now he lodge from one hotel. Now the wife they call him. Where are you there? Say I did, I did, I did. What's the name of the hotel? I never had the name. Oh, where are you there? Address. And the wife said, Go and get me the address. So. Go and get me the name of the hotel. He said, he said wait till I be small picking. Ah, I don't lodge now. Nah, 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 nah. The wife said, no. Me I don't agree. Give me the name of the hotel. Alaye Hotel. Which street? Uh, uh, where the street? Give me the whole thing. Snap the picture. Send that to me. Go to the receptionist. Go make call. Make the session. Don't say you. They follow me talk. Where you are mentioning the name of the hotel. Everything. He said, as the man they put so nice in the casino, call in friends who cause John. Eventually, the man sent all the information. You mind the tell him for the session person. I be small picking, huh? Make I give you the name of the, 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 the hotel. Okay, they tell is this hotel. This is number so so. so. See the session is there my front end. I mean they talk. Now he put up for a video call. Now he showed the session his face, everything. When he reached out the following time, where he reached out. Now, wife, they explain to her. Now, the husband say, "I understand." At first, I didn't understand, but later, I understood. Thank you very much, my darling. You've got to be caring. Correct him with love. Complain about what you do, um, what you do not like that he did or does, and do it very politely. Watching his best mood. That's the best time to complain when he's in a very happy mood, excited mood. Don't ever pick his course. He no send you message. Are you his PA? Don't pick his course. You can take the phone to him. You have a call. Give him surprise birthday gifts, birthday bash, and so on and so forth. These are some of the things that they don't do to us before we they our memory, not they get clean. So you add your own. Add so many that good things you feel you can do to your man. Maybe say Ingo they long for you. No, go bed. Go to show skill. I'll not tell you that one, no. Or you go, you reach for night, and you drag your husband, they go bed. Dali, let's go, let's go. You must kill me today. Eh? A lot of men, they like him. I don't know that your husband feel like him. Unless you know saying like him, you feel they do him. But if you know, you don't study and say no like him. Hmm. With yourself, oh, there's a way woman take the little man to bed. Make her begin to tell you, no. Time not day. But you know, as a woman, what you do, how you do, and where the man body go, you know, say, now nah, invitation. Not me to open mouth, say, darling, get inside. Are you a woman? They tell your husband, get inside. Let's go to the room now. Before you know, the man will begin to think which kind of life you live before. So be very careful. Be very, very careful. So give him some birthday batches and birthday gifts, surprises for him. It's very, very important. It leaves memories um, behind. And any day you are not around, he will miss you. Maybe the other woman waiting can't jam. No, they do so. We we'll say, ah, this this one uh, not be this thing. At the end of the day, you go see another begin plan. Hang go take go back to you. Even though that one don't bump for us, say no go matter for her. because that one no fit match your record of loving, of caring, of understanding, of being prayerful, of being there for him, being supportive, 
and so on and so forth. So if you want your man not to want to lose you, or if you do mistake making comeback or making the long for you, uh, these are the things, some of the things you do, you can add your own if need be. All right. Make a stop and there. Nine minutes, nine don't pass midnight. We have about just 15 more minutes or so um, for us to pack our bag and baggage and leave here. We should be taking a lot of calls um, from this way. But I would like to take another short break, just two minutes of music. I'll be back. I'll begin to take the calls and listen to you. And then we'll talk together. This is Love Clinic on Adam Muguna 3.1 FM with your love therapist, Femi Tyro Stone. The man will not the smoke, will not the drink. The Otilos are one of Adam Muguna 3.1 FM. I did here with O oh Baby. Will they come back? Nah, 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 nah. No, they don't know what's going on. When I get so, when I get so, when I get so, my baby boy. Fine, fine girls um, 
your mother born you where uh, you are beautiful you fine you do this you do that thank you so much um um flavor flavor that's a great one that's a great one there so this is love clinic on adabi mogo ninety um 3.1 fm my name is femi taiwo stone your love therapist i know they spoke i know they drink i'll be ochi laws one of um adabi mogo 93.1 fm um today happens to be my birthday today is my birthday um uh, no yesterday yesterday 13th of um june yes yesterday was my birthday because we are already um on wednesday now we're already on wednesday so all right let me take um look at um before we start taking your cosmonautics let's take some of the messages we have here king mz ayorinde says well done um so dick and your lao lan he also says um well done and then of course um um easy fresh okay also is saying well done thank you very much and then i have a gbk um salaudin uh gbk okay that should be a woman she says happy birthday sir uh okay thank you very much and then uh arami yahaya mm, arani yahaya says well done and then Olawale, God help Tajudin is also saying, um, well done, sir. Well done, sir. Okay, thank you so much for the messages. Ajibade uh, Ahmed, it's a best of best program for Ipaja, Ayobo, Lagos. Good of you, thank you. And then uh, Amode Usman says, well done, forward never, backward never from um, Chifu, Omo, uh, Amode one for lagos island thank you very much and i have tunde razak it says your um love clinics are your okay are wonderful and your advice is um superb you are highly impressive and educative uh program it is keep it up thank you very much um tunde razak thank you very much and of course i also have tunde razak still talking here he say you are performing wonderfully well on the um health clinics okay love clinics program please advise me advise them okay afolabi shegun karim says best job best work and ogunle ye ganiyat abiola um first time of listening to this program i love the topic you treated today a baby from ikorodu thank you very much madam thank you and then this one akimi badon is saying hello Good evening, sir. Good evening. And then Gani, you are saying good job from Amukoko. All right. From Amukoko. All right. And Tunde Razak, uh, Femi Taiwo, my brother. My name is Tunde Razak from uh, Ori of Ukoko. Ojoloko Gometeria. I am a lover of your radio station. The topic tonight is inspiring and educative. Men and women are decisive in nature. Yeah, yeah, so you put it there. Thank you very much, Tunde Razak. And then, Ijobala, uh, Ijoba, okay. Good work. Olamile uh, BJ says, Ambology from Magburu. From Magburu. Tonight's topic is educative. Thank you very much. God bless you. And then, Ken Bakari says, Ken Bakari, happy birthday to you, sir. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Today, um, yesterday was my birthday. And I'm celebrating all through this week. Um, um, I wish myself long life and prosperity in good health in Jesus' name. All right. Let's get down to business. I'm on Facebook at Dami Mogunai 3.1 FM. I'm there live right now. Please let me call your friends and um, brothers and colleagues and families to join me on Facebook at, at Dami Mogunai 3.1 FM. YouTube, the same thing. Um, TikTok, um, Instagram, and um, others. Just join me there tonight. And um, let's 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 um, rub minds. Okay. All right. The numbers to call um zero eight zero five five eight 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 one nine two or zero eight zero five five eight 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 one nine three. I'll take it again more slowly. Zero eight zero five five eight 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 one nine two zero eight zero five five eight 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 one nine three. Those are the two lines. Hello? 
Hello? I've peaked, I've peaked, and I'm not hearing you. Hello? 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 Good morning. Good morning. I'm fine. What's your name? My name is uh, Philip. Eh? Philip. Philip, okay. Calling from where? From Ogun State. Where in Ogun State? Okay. Imo. Okay. Yeah. Thank you for Thank calling you. For, uh, thank you for this uh, program. Okay. Please reduce the volume of your radio set. Okay. Hello. All right. Please carry on, sir. Uh, I like the program very well. Thank you, sir. But, but the only thing that I see in a human life mm. is very bad. Mm. Women, anything that they don't like from their uh, conscience is a big problem. So women can hide their uh, self. And Yoba, Yoba, you're just a of Thank you, sir. Ami, sir. Thank you, sir. Ami, sir. Ami, sir. Thank you, sir. All right. That makes the line free. I hope you heard um, uh, what Maoga said. He said uh, uh, human life is uh, bad. There are anything women don't like, they reject, they pretend a lot. That it's all about money, that whatever, whatever, whatever you do for them, they don't um, value it except you have money. So that is his own, um, my um, August opinion there. Um, anyway, everybody is speaking from their own uh, point of um, um, understanding. So I'll put it that way point of understanding. Okay, so call us on 0805. Um zero eight zero five five eight 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 one nine two. I repeat zero eight zero five five eight 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 one nine two or zero eight zero five five eight 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 uh one nine three. Hello? Hello, sir. Good evening, sir. Good evening, sir. Yeah, my name is Samuel Akintunde Ayeni. Samuel Akintunde Ayeni. Calling from where? I'm calling from Shongo Tedo, Aja. Okay, good evening. I will, I, in first and foremost, let me wish you happy birthday. Ah, thank you, sir. Thank you very much. God, I don't call. Ami. Ami. Ami, sir. Ami, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah, um, uh, I, I have been following up your program, not even your own program alone, other presenter. In oh, no, Dami Mogo. Yes, yes, sir. I even, I want to watch someone is Dre. Uh, yes, I, I didn't you. Yeah. program yesterday, yes, sir. Thank so you. let me not cut uh, so long for others to call in. I believe many Nigerians, many people all over the world are hearing me now. I'm a single father about three years back now. Okay. Uh, it's a very long story. So I think I've been trying to let my uh, baby mama listen to your radio about two or three days back now but well, i don't know maybe probably this might be online now but i i i wish maybe others that i know what most of us told in badagos will be listening to our program now 
I still receive some calls concerning our issues tonight from the other family. But in your program I had tonight touched some of my heart, my inner mood. But the most important, I want to ask a little question, maybe you or others may easily come calling, okay. is that is it a, a compulsory object for a man and a woman compulsory in let me say the, the relationship or the marriage will never work because come, come there are a lot of things I said I'm only 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 Okay, okay, okay. Yes, sir. All right. Um, um, yes, sir. I don't know. Maybe there's a way you can copy my number or your own personal number. If you can, after this program, I will try tomorrow and call you from for some other counseling. Oh, yeah. On my Nobody's perfect. She has her own photos. Mm. Yes, sir. But she still proves as if maybe and our other uh, church needs you won't be laying here. So in connection with Jolly Lori, you say, you told me you need you so old here. Say it's a stolen property that I have no right on now. And but to comment here, what you are, what you are, what you are, what you are, what Okay. Okay. I will give. I will give. I will drop my personal number. Okay, sir. At the end of the program. Thank you. Thank you. Amisa. Abisa. Odaro. Right. Um. Number one thing is um. Mm, Mr. Samuel, normally, no, you are supposed to have gone to do what you are supposed to do. Um, you have not taken the consent of the family. Your two families have not come together to bless your union. To bless your union. You are an African man. So you know what that also uh, uh, means. Then there's always a blessing that goes with marriage. Some people will say not all marriages. I agree. There's always a blessing that goes with marriage. The worst of the blessings can be children. There's always there's a when a man who find it um, a good wife find it good thing. Man who find it a wife find it good thing, and obtain it favor from God. Uh, I think there's a particular kind of a blessing that goes with um, getting married um, officially. Officially in the sense that you do traditional. You know, churches won't wed you unless you have done traditional um, uh, wedding. Uh, say maybe, I don't know, maybe some churches or uh, house of God do it too. But majority, they will only agree to do your wedding if you have done traditional marriage where the two parents have consented. Um, you see, when you marry, the second reason, apart from that blessing, Second reason why you should do your marriage, even if it's just traditional, is that uh, you, the man, cannot use the girl and dump her and just go easily like that. And the woman, too, cannot just carry her bag and baggage and go easily like that. Yes, uh, because the parents will, will be involved. 
your parents' appearance will be involved. Uh, the church or mosque or traditional home will be involved. Friends and families will be involved because it is marriage. You are not just living partner. You are living. If you do living partner, the church believes what you have done is fornication. That's why that church was not supporting you. They believe what you have done is fornication. That you didn't marry her legitimately. When they said you you say stolen property, that's what they mean. From the parents. And don't forget this Africa. There are some mothers or fathers who are not happy that you have taken their daughter away without doing the right thing. Oh, respect one upon one lay. Oh, pay homage. Oh, je kon show pa wani baba wani ya omo. Oh, je ki won ba glory. Lo jo e ye omo won. So if the mother or the father has any power, they can use it to, to frustrate your life and you may for not doing the right thing. I'm just saying that this is Africa. This is Africa. Uh -huh. So you are supposed to have gone there to do what you are supposed to do. These days it might not be too loud. A few family members, a few friends, a few family members, a few friends from both sides. And you've done the marriage. So far your parents have consented to it and you go there, you proceed, you lie down, you pay the dowry, you whatever. My brother, you are good to go. In so doing, you have secured that marriage. You have secured that woman, you have secured that man. But if you don't do that, you have not done what you are supposed to do. And the blessings of marriage might not follow you. But again, I also understand, I don't know how true it is, that once you have started living together for years like that, that the law recognizes you as husband and wife. That is the law. The parents who are the parents of the girl, your parents, you as a man, have not consented. That's very, very important traditionally, spiritually. They have not consent. They have to consent. They have to hand you over the woman. It's not because she's subtle, she's loving, she's, she loves you. You just carry her and put in the house and you are just uh, uh, enjoying her away. No. All right. Hello? Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Thank you, sir. Yeah. What's the name? Eh? Bosse from Ikorodu. Bosse. Yeah. Okay. Bosse from Ikorodu. How are you? I'm fine. Your voice is very low. You never chop. So make it loud a bit for me. Now I'm listening to you. How are you doing? Um, I'm fine. I just want to comment on the man that was that was speaking that way. Okay. Are very dangerous. Okay.
we will go to Africa together. So we started planning that, okay, how are we going to do things now that good parents have known that they are very passionate worried that we are going to, we are very sick. We are going to pay the diary and everything. Later we said that I'm the owner of the, I'm the one that paid for the apartment. I wasn't believing like that. And I, I gave him all the respect, all the respect he deserved. Even, we, we don't, at times we talk money. I want mine. I will use my own money to provide to do so many things in the house. So, one of the children, I started noticing this man's character. What is happening? If I ask him like this, he would scream and he shout from me. If I try to just ask him questions like this, I don't know what to do. I talked to my pastor in the church. He tried calling me. No, he said, he's a Muslim. He's a Muslim. But when he came, me, I'm, I, I'm a Christian. He was, he was, he was telling me that he followed me to church. I, I, I've not seen this kind of person before. He's not that way. I love following me to church. So, like that, like that, now. He, he just came one of the Sunday. My pastor asked me one day. I told my pastor that that is he asked me very well. That where did I wrong him? He said, no, I didn't wrong him. I didn't do him anything. So what is happening? So there was a day I was trying to look for what is happening, what is the truth? So he was speaking and took his phone. So I checked his phone. I saw, I saw he, he did um, he, he did the, the lady in the house that two of them. Um, what do they call it? The first thing? A snapshot. We did snapshot together. They were laughing together and all that. So I look at the snapshot. I said, this man that will never laugh in the house. He said, okay. So I kept praying and praying and praying. I kept going to church and praying. Doing everything in the hand of God. So, one day, he told me that he doesn't want me to get pregnant. That he, that he doesn't even want me to, that he doesn't want the mistake to happen. So we we'll pay in the house and one two months, we won't touch him. At times I called the mother, I told the mother that still, still, the mother will tell that they told him that they shouldn't touch the woman. At that. So when did all this start? So he would travel without telling me, without even telling me, informing me. He would just go as if he's not living with the woman then. Even if it returns and I try to ask him, is he going to come to a story or shout? I don't know what to do. The, the mother kept on calling me, calling me down. Like, I said, I'm not bad. You are. My love is so young. My love is so young. I just want that. So I now have to invite my mom. My mom, the mom is sure what is happening now. This is what this person has been doing. My mom was surprised at So you see person all day. I said yes. My mom said that you didn't deserve all this now. Why would you be behaving this way? So my mom came to talk to me. So my mom came around. Even then. He traveled. We don't have the same in our home. He said he's traveling. I said, okay. So we, you know we don't have anything in our home. Where did you get the money we are living? We want to use to travel. And the next place we are going to, we just came back from that same place two weeks ago. At least we stayed there for long, for up to three weeks. So what are you now going there to do? So he saw he left, he traveled. He said, okay, no problem. So I called my mom. My mom came in. So that day I was not around when he returned. So my mom tried to talk to him. So he told my mom that, okay, that he wants my mom to settle everything. So my mom surprised. That night he left, he didn't return, he didn't come home. 
He didn't even respect the fact that he told my mom. My mom said when he was leaving, I just told her that he is coming back. I just want to give somebody something. That is coming back. Now, so, boss, yeah? please, before you go very far, because of time, let me ask you. How old is he? How old are you? How old is he? His age and your age? Like five years older than me. How old? Mm. Is he 90 or 100? He's 40, 40, 44, going to 45. And I am 49, 39. At 39 years. Okay. Yeah, what, what, what is his uh, academic qualification? He's a pharmacist. He's a pharmacist. Good. What is your own qualification? Okay. Are you a pharmacist? A medical school. Me, I am not a pharmacist. What do you do? I do business. Huh? Business administration. That means you went to University of Poly? Yeah, just um, I did some course on business and admin. But your normal qualification would have been school search, right? No, but I went for some courses. Like, um, um, Did you do it in a polytechnic, NC, or university? NC. Hmm? Yes. Boss, tell me the truth, oh, so I know how to tell you what to do. Oh. Yes. You have NC? Yes. Okay. Did they do business at me for NC? Eh? Bosse. Is a, okay, is a, is a course I did under this school, then um, this secretarial study stuff. So it's a course I did there. So from there, we, we wrote the exam and everything. After you finished your second school, that's when you did that? Yes. But you didn't do it in the College of Education? No, no, no. Okay. Um, how many years have we been together? It's not even up to a year. That you've been together? Okay. Um, he comes to your house, right? Yes. Do you know his family? Yes. Mm, is he married? He was. He was. They, they broke up. They broke up. Like how many children do they, does he have? You know, you, are, you don't even know him too well. That is true. He his biological children are two. Okay. Where is the former wife staying? I don't know where the former wife is staying. That is where the former wife stays around the Colorado school. So he just told you he has um, two kids? that uh, himself and the wife have separated. Yes. Does he even come... My family told me, I tried finding out even from the mother, she told me the same thing, and God forbid that he can never return to the wife. Um, he comes to your house, right? Yeah, but he has stopped coming. Mm -mm, just answer my question. He used to come to your house. We were staying together, living good, together. Good, good. And... Um, you were sleeping together, right? Yes. And now he has changed behavior. Yes. Do you have any kid for him? No, 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 not at all. Bosse. Eh? Bosse. Eh? How many times did I call you? Hmm? You want me to be very blunt with you? Yeah. Uh, but so you see, um, whatever you have done is not new. It's a common mistake women make. 
common mistake that women make. Number one, boss, are you with me? You see, medical doctor, pharmacist, uh, physiotherapist, gynecologist, anything under medical that has graduated. Don't let them tell you lies. They have somebody somewhere. At least 90% of them have somebody somewhere. You know why? They be hot cake for markets. They are hot cake in the market. Women, they rush them. I say tomorrow, not day. So where you go in pharmacy school? Go university, read pharmacy, to take, come aside, graduate. Abba, what's it supposed to say somebody go there? Or maybe the pharmacist where you they talk. Now, the one where just they sell medicine. Did he go to university to read pharmacy? Yes, he's working at the general hospital. He got to the general hospital. Now, you don't go there. You've been there before. You saw him. I've been there before. Even before we met, I've been there before. From the gate, right there to the office. They know them. He's a popular person there. They know them very well. Now, Bosse. The man that refused to also respect your mother. Am I correct? Yes. But I make I tell you the truth. Move on. Not vex so. I did force today blunt with you. Move on. You've sold yourself to him too cheap. Too cheaply. Move on, my darling. Move on. Move on, move on, mm. and I know Guma I deceive you. Say uh, something will come out of this Jerusalem. I don't see anything they come out. One, like I said, is a pharmacist, a hot cake. He get wife and children somewhere. Tell you say they separate. I don't believe it. I don't believe him. Are ah, you even sure? Say the person we in carry you go show. Say my mama, my mama be that. Are ah, you sure? That's two. Three. When you go to check him in the office, you know now nobody will tell you the truth now. Nobody will tell you the truth, say, it just they use you. Nobody will tell you. They'll greet you where, yahoo, wa, yahoo, wa, that's what they'll say. Then in your own house, now in the calm. Calm the, ah, no, 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 bosse. Bosse, no. That first, those few steps you took uh, is not too good. No vex. But, like I told you, everybody, they make mistake. Oh, that is why pencils have erasers. So what you do for me is take take my number at the end of the program. Um, there are some things I can't tell you now on radio that I will tell you. Uh, you will just give me a call uh -huh. or send me a voice note. So you understand. Uh, but for this relationship, Bose, God now they beg you. Come on your mind there. Come on your mind there. But because you are 39, you are still very young. There's a lot of future ahead of you. So this mistake, nobody only did me where I stand here, so I don't do mistake. We they're very costly for me. We pain me, reach my heart. So everybody they make mistake. Forget there's nothing you have done that is bad, that is wrong. It's just common mistake that ladies make. Are you with me? Yes, and you see this God where we deserve. It can because of your pure mind, your clean heart. Can't give you another angel, another man will go worship you. Where you no go believe, say this can man feed day for this life. So his zone is not the end of the world. So if you need to sit down and cry, cry make you get better. Me was sit down here so bossy. I don't cry before. Not be once, not be twice. Where a woman broke my heart through a piece of sand, I cry like a baby. But by the time you come out of that tears, you become stronger. You become wiser. So please call me uh, when I drop my number. Let's talk. There are one or two things I'm still going to tell you that I can't tell you on radio. Okay, All right. Thank, thank you, Bosse. Thank you. I really appreciate it. All right. Take care. All right. Um, that is that. 
uh, anybody they make mistake nothing uh, there's nothing new in that mistake that uh, uh, boss made hello? hello wow all right hello hello good evening good evening sir yeah, my name is Olamide from Ekuti. Olamide? Yes, sir. From where? From Ekuti, Bejuleki. Okay, Bejuleki. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, about the uh, relationship I want to talk about. We have just five minutes. Can we use it? Okay. Yeah, no problem. Okay. So, what of a man? Because apparently I'm not American, 45 years old. Okay. And then my wife is late. Okay. So now I have a, a woman in the right now I can talk it to you. Sorry, how many children so you get from your late wife? Three. Okay. Carry on. Yeah. So as I speak to you now, I have a one gay friend. So, and then what I hear from the, from the radio now that he said we should be careful for our wife and this and that. Mm. So what of a woman that I tried, I tried to do all my best to her and then didn't appreciate it? Mm. Like now when your wife, uh, when your wife goes to market and you go to work, before she came back, you have already made anything. Maybe you make me food and this and that. Then she comes back, she now eat and then to to uh, to clear the table of the other things she will use. And then in the in the morning before she went up to make a lot of you at home and then to do everything that woman supposed to do at home she reverse. So what advice do you want to advise me about that? You see number one when um um you see say your wife is not appreciating you, your wife is not appreciating what you do your wife is not trying to make you happy. Your wife is not trying or the okay, I mean sometimes the the love no is not done. Mm, sometimes the love not the day. Mm, it costs a lot of women these days just to find where they will put their head. Where they go they get uh, three times uh, food. Where they go get somebody where go they take care of them. They might not really love the man. They might not really love the man. That's very, very important. You have to watch out to know whether this woman likes you or loves you. Once you say love, no day, find your level. Because any relationship will love, no day, forget that. Suffer, you go suffer tired. Okay, okay no. Maybe after this. Uh, this uh, so, sorry, Ogami, one, one thing that I would have loved to tell you. Mm. You are 45, you have three children, right? Yeah. Uh, for this is my good. Yes, see, bros, uh, not vex. Make I just say this before because of time. Um, if Nami be you, I get three children, I no need wife for now. I no need wife for now. The highest I will probably have is a girlfriend. I no need wife. I want to concentrate and train those children. I want to concentrate and train those children very well. Very, very important because when you bring home a wife now can come and frustrate the life of these three children. These are your Ogola. So, if I were you, I would concentrate. Leave women for now. Concentrate on the children. Concentrate on your business. Concentrate on yourself. Make yourself more handsome, more comfortable, and take good care of your children. Along the line, where you do that, you go to meet women. You go to shine your eye. Don't go into any deep relationship for now. Okay. Yes. God will help you. Just maybe you call me tomorrow or uh, later in the day. Okay. Uh, um, talk. talk yes. Uh, I'll call my number now. I'll call my number now. Okay. Uh, Thanks. All right, sir. Good Thank night. you, sir. Good yes, sir. Night. Yes, sir. Good night, sir. Time don't, time don't go away. Can I take this?
Okay. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. Hello. Hello. Oh, baby. That one not grip you. Cool. Hello. Hello. Yeah, and she. Ah, nearly take you call more by you, sir. My business, sir. Uh, okay. uh, let me give my again for your personal number. Me, uh, uh, no, uh, 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 you call me later in the day. Uh, I'll call it now. Everybody, I'll call it now. Everybody will hear. Am I worried? No problem, sir. No problem, sir. All right, sir. Yes, sir. All right, all right. Um, let me thank Kayo De Ajayi. I always enjoy your program. Uh, Prof. Professor Femi, keep it up. It takes um, wisdom to talk about home and relationship. Thank you, Jerry. You know, easy. Uh, my own opinion is that those ladies that uh, really need this advice are not listening right now. Ladies based relationship on money. Uh, let them go and listen on Facebook. Adamogo 93.1 FM is always there. You can play even old editions. They are all there. Uh, Kenny Bakari, happy birthday to you, sir. Okay, thank you, Mr. Kenny. I did do it Sunday. Thank you very much. And Olami Lake on BG, okay, I've, I've read that one before. Says I'm, um, I'm Bolaji from Magburu. Thank you very much. Tonight's topic is educative. Eshe, eshe. All right. Thank you very much. Um, I will say that. Um, okay. Uh, please join us on um, um, Facebook at Adamimogo uh, 93.1 FM to go and look at um, the um, this edition and other editions. They are all there. And then I'm going to uh, share it onto my own uh, Facebook page um, later in the day. Uh, you can also go to our YouTube page, um, Adamogna 3.1 FM. Go to TikTok, go to Twitter. We are there. You can watch all our programs, including this Love Clinic. Um, they help us to share, help us to like, help us to follow, help us to pass your comments, help us to subscribe. Any of the pages you get to just do what you're supposed to do there for us. That's the much we are asking from you. Um, um, for us, and also on my own social media handles, um, talk we make sense. Talk we make sense. That's the title. Um, talk we make sense on TikTok, on Facebook, and on YouTube. You see all of these programs. Another comedy um, talk, another talk on safety, security, and relationship are also there. And then on Instagram, my name is Femi Stones 2014. You get me there, and every other thing, comedy, short, short talk and then these um, programs. Thank you very much. And um, if you want to sponsor this program, please don't forget to call on 080-55-888-171 or 080-55-888-172. Yes. Now, my own personal number, 0802-329-2640. I repeat, 0802-329-2640. That is my own personal um, um, number. So call me there or send me voice notes. Don't call me now. Don't call me now. Don't call me now. Uh -huh. So you can call me there and um, let's talk about your issue or uh, whatever. But don't forget to go to Taiwo Femi or Talk We Make Sense on Facebook. Two pages on Facebook, Taiwo Femi or Talk We Make Sense. And to others also, Talk We Make Sense on TikTok, um, YouTube. Uh, and then you go to Instagram where you get me, Femi Stones 2014. That's where I will be. Thank you so very much. My name is Femi Taiwo Stone. The program has been Love Clinic on Adamimogo 93.1 FM. The man will not smoke, will not drink. Ochilos are one of Adam 3.1 FM. Thank you very much. I thank you so much. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Thank you very much for your hands on the buttons, for the beautiful music and everything. Um, for my listeners, I say, join me today after the today. Today is already Wednesday by 12.30 p.m. for Make We Talk Sense. 12.30 p.m. today. Adam 3.1 FM for Make We Talk Sense. I'll still be there today. 
Thank you very much. Until some other time, that is next week, Tuesday, when I come your way by his grace. For now, I am saying bye-bye. Oh.